uh, here's, the, here's, you know, the, here's the elephant in the room in this conversation. <laughs> I'm think, the elephant in the room. No, no, I just think that her concern, the same with uh, Mrs. Powell, was that their husbands are black, and it's still dangerous for a black man to want to. Well, you raised it. You know, I, I have always. Well, you uh, know, that's what that, that's what it is. I, it, well, it, it's part of it. Um, I've always, you know, made it a point to be reluctant to talk about security in a presidential campaign because you never want to raise the raise the topic. But because it's come up, um, uh, it's something that they have to figure out. Um, and um, uh, I think they will, by the way. And I think the atmosphere around him in Manchester on I Sunday so. is a is a good example that the mood. It, it, it's not. You know, again, Obama's different because he doesn't come out of the civil rights movement as you and I know it. Yes. Uh, he's a very different figure. In some ways, his appeal is non-racial, not racial. Um, and, um, uh, and so I don't think uh, he's the kind of person that, that elicits uh, strong feelings, particularly the negative kind, the way someone else might. Well. Uh, and um, uh, obviously, it's something they have to think about. They have to be prudent. Uh, you have to be sensible. This is not about being irresponsible because because of what's involved. Here's, here's what but I think. The question is, is there a way to do this prudently? And the answer is yes. You don't even need Secret Service. Here's what I think. I think uh, that they defeated Harold Ford Jr. in Tennessee with a white woman on television, but they'd have shot him if they'd have had to. So that's uh, where we are. Yeah, 